Hello, 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 hello. How are you guys doing? Thank you guys so much for joining the Tierra's Tarot. I appreciate you guys clicking onto my video. This video before all my beautiful and my handsome Sagittarius is out there. How y'all doing? How y'all doing? Keep in mind that this is a gentle reading, so it's not going to resonate with every Sagittarius. So please take the parts that does resonate, so what doesn't leave it on out. Also, this could be the past, the present, or in the future, and to be aware of any scammers in the comment section pretending to be your girl, okay? So, Sagittarius. The card that came out was 2222. Okay, it says gratitude, peace, and resilience. Okay, it says cultivate an attitude of gratitude. Okay, reflecting on the blessings in your life. Take time to breathe deeply, savoring the peace that comes with stillness. Yes. Sagittarius, okay? Build resilience by facing each day with courage and open heart, ready for life's adventures, okay? So I think that that's what you could be doing, okay? In the month of October, you could be seeing the number 2222 a lot in the month of October, okay? Yeah, you're going to be feeling very gratitude, very grateful, okay? I said gratitude. You're going to be feeling very grateful is what I'm getting here, okay? For the blessings for where you're at right now, okay, in the month of October, all right? You're going to be basically, it says peace be still. So you're going to be still, not as far as in like, oh, you're stagnant. No, I'm just saying you're going to be, you're going to find this new profound peace is what I'm getting here in the month of October. You're going to see that everything is coming in alignment, okay, for you. Oh, wow. Oh, yeah. So you're going to be receiving peace in the month of October because you maybe have to deal with a lot of people that was immature. OK. All right. It says right now I'm not really at a place in my life where I can fulfill the demands of a healthy relationship. So there could be somebody around you that's being very fucking immature. OK. But they see you in this Zen, peaceful energy. It's like, yeah, it says it's mutual. In case you were wondering, yes, I'm feeling you too. Wow. So in case you're wondering if somebody was feeling you, they are feeling you. This person is saying, I'm ready. Okay. I'm ready to find my life partner and settle down. And settle down. This could be you, Sagittarius. Maybe you're ready to find your life partner and settle down. Okay. There could be somebody here that is feeling you. Okay, the feelings are mutual, but there's some type of immature energy here as well. Okay, is what I'm getting here. Yeah, something about a secret. There's something I haven't been completely honest about. Okay, hopefully that's just their feelings and nothing else. Let's see. Um, let's see. What is these secrets, spirit? Here, fine. Oh, Lord. I don't know. Sagittarius, you either married to this person, Sagittarius, or... Oh, Lord. Um, they're married, okay? What's the secret? Mm. The magician. And then a nine of wands. This could be a player that could be immature. That's throwing magic at your marriage or your union. Because right here it says it's mutual and you're ready to settle down. Maybe you're trying to settle down with somebody. Maybe you're at peace because everything is coming in alignment with your life. You finally found someone that's a go. Okay. And you're ready to settle down with this individual. Okay. And they are feeling the same way. Whoever this new person is or what have you. Okay. But then you got some immature motherfucker that's been keeping secrets about the fact that they've been throwing magic at you. Whoever this player energy is, okay, at your relationship or new relationship is what I'm getting. Yeah, to get somebody to reject you or hold back with the four of pentacles, okay, or to have you have your guard up against this new individual, okay, is what I'm getting. Yeah, ten of cups. This could have been a player that you may have had children with or, like I said, you want to take action towards the ten of cups energy, Maybe even have a family with somebody or maybe even a blended family, okay? But this king of swords is not feeling it, okay? It's like they want to basically betray you and then walk away is what I'm getting. Yeah, empress. You definitely could be this empress here. This person sees you as their empress as well. And they don't want nobody else to have that energy of the empress is what I'm getting. So they're trying to come in and betray you or end things with a situation that you're dealing with right now. Okay, because they don't want you to be ended up being pregnant and then it's really going to fuck them up or what have you is what I'm getting. That's what I heard. Like somebody don't want you to end up getting pregnant by somebody. 
being with somebody or whatever like that. Wow. Yeah. Six of Swords. You're moving away from this person. You have found some type of new love, okay? And it could be an empress straight up. You manifested this emperor in your life. Now we got the empress and the emperor, okay? Yeah, you moved away from this past person so you could find somebody that you can settle down with, okay? And you you probably did or you will in the month of October, okay? But then you're going to have this other person coming in trying to start some drama, so be aware of that. And this person already been sending you negative energy. Already been damn doing some type of witchcraft on your ass. Wow, we got the Ten of Pentacles. Like I said, this landed right on the Ten of Swords. Somebody is trying to end your foundation, your money, your household, your peace of mind. Okay? Disturb your peace in your home or what have you. This is their plan, Sagittarius. It's to disturb your peace. Okay? Yeah, to stop you from healing. Yeah, this person keeps watching to see if you have healed. Or for some of y'all, this could be an Aquarius that's watching. But I'm definitely getting there. Somebody that's watching to see if you are a star, if you are shining, if you have healed from a situation or something like that. So this could be somebody that's studying your emotions. Okay, it's like they're looking at you, Sagittarius, and they're studying your emotions. They're trying to see if you're happy or sad or mad or what have you. But they see, all they see is what, or they will see that you're at peace, Sagittarius. That's what the fuck they're about to see. Okay? Or that's what they see. Yeah. They see that you went through some type of a transformation. They're going through a rebirth. Okay? And they are so upset about this. They don't know how to handle this. Okay? Is what I'm getting. So this person could be resorting to magic. To try to fuck with the Sagittarius. I can't make it up. Death magic at that. Sex magic, somebody could be like, they don't want you fucking with somebody. They don't want you be getting, like, hot and bothered. Not I won't say bothered, but hot and ready for somebody, okay? Because this person hot and bothered, okay? But they don't want you hot and ready for somebody else. If you get what I'm saying, Sagittarius. So, you definitely have somebody, yeah, King of Wands, okay? The Ten of Wands. So, somebody is definitely trying to burden the fuck out you. This is somebody from your past. This is an ex or what have you. You could be a masculine Sagittarius or somebody trying to overburden. This could be like a baby mother or what have you that you had a child with. If you are a masculine Sagittarius, okay? And maybe it's like you're ready to settle down with somebody. And this woman is upset because she does not want you to end up marrying somebody because she feel like you should have been marrying her. You got the kids by her or family or something, okay? Put it where it fits. But, or like, my, like I said, my feminine energies. You got rid of a loser, okay? Rid of somebody that was immature, okay? And you went and found somebody else or somebody came and found you. Okay, because him that seeketh, okay, shall findeth a good wife. Okay, you feel me? Type of energy. Yeah, four of wands. I'm telling you, queen of cups, four of wands. Wow. For some of y'all, this could be a, a Pisces, a Scorpio, or a Cancer feminine energy that this masculine could even be, what? dealing with or something or for some of y'all we got the queen of cups and the king of cups so some of y'all are definitely in love but with the seven of swords there's some sneaky shit going on maybe from friends or family members or what have you or somebody had a third party what is the seven of swords the three of cups or maybe that's what this person did whoever this person is that's throwing you negativity yeah i'm telling you somebody here wants to there's a third party or a third will somebody could feel like a third will okay Whoever this ex is is immature, feel like they're they are a third wheel and you abandoned them and you let them go. Okay. So they've been doing some shit sneaky towards you, your household, whoever you're trying to date, and everything of that nature. Okay. Somebody's upset. Yeah, there's a queen of swords that could be attacking you as well. Or you could be voicing your opinion or fighting back. Here you go. Yeah, Queen of Wands against some type of lies. Okay. This could be friends, but it's like you got your back, though, and you're sticking up for yourself is what I'm getting. What else, spirit? What is this immature? What else is this immature person doing? Because that is serious. Possesses a talisman to amplify positive vibes. OK, I'm hearing with this, though, I'm getting an uh, enabler. So this person stays around people that enables their behavior. Okay, it's what I'm getting. 
Yes, yeah, says you cut them off and they're still watching. What I say? Yeah, they're upset because you cut them off. Someone is doing, I can't make it up. I can't make it up, Sagittarius. So just be aware. Someone is doing black magic juju. Okay, work on you. That's what they're doing. I just said that. Because mm -mm -mm. they're upset. They're upset that you're moving on. Yeah, hates tweets. So this person is saying hate tweets about you. Yeah, personality disorder. They try to convince people that, you know, saying they're bigger than they are. They actually are. Okay, they're spreading rumors about you. We know that. Yeah. Yeah, so for some of y'all, pray before you go to sleep as well. Okay? Yeah, you got a crazy motherfucker. Yeah. Upset because you, you cut them off. So now it's like they made it their job to study you, watch you, or what have you. Okay? So just be mindful. But at the end of the day, it's not going to matter, Sagittarius, because once again, especially if you're seeing the numbers 2222, it's like you're at peace right now. You are at peace. You don't care about what this immature motherfucker doing. They could try to throw every type of witchcraft you do at you, baby. At the end of the day, you're happy and you're at peace. Okay? So... If they're disturbed, let them be disturbed, okay? But you, on the other hand, Sagittarius, you're going to be good, baby, okay? But I do see you standing up for yourself. I do see you maybe speaking up or saying what's on your mind, okay? It's what I'm getting here. Maybe you're going to say another tweet back. Like, I don't know. Maybe you're not, like I said, you're not even going to entertain this person because you're so at peace that nobody can disturb it. Nobody can disturb your peace is what I'm getting. But just know, Sagittarius, that you got somebody watching and studying your emotions and your moods and just to see if you're happy or not okay like this person is a weirdo okay so just know that in the month of october how this person is going to be all up in your business okay or trying to be all right but all right i love you guys so freaking much sagittarius y'all need anything else from me uh look in the description box below or check out my tiktok account okay love you guys bye